We're left with two world title fights. Two absolute belters. Tyler Goodjohn against Sean George will be next. That's for the world featherweight title. Seven two-minute rounds. Followed by the world lightweight title between Jean-Carlos Prada and Jimmy Sweeney. Uh, I mean, they're absolutely mouth-watering. Uh, listen, Tom, at the end of the day, uh, any of the fights that have gone on, to, or all of the fights that have gone on so far tonight, are going to take oh, some beating. For sure. <laughs> you know, when uh, we've got the chance of that with two world titles, you know, they are going to take some beating. It's, but I'm sure they... I mean, Tyler Goodjohn's coming to this sport. Two. He's been bang bang. He's won and he's looked absolutely super technical fighter again. Yeah, and you know, and, and we look at his record as well. You know, his pro record, his pro boxing record. You know, 13 wins, five losses, no draws. Uh, another guy. One of those losses was to John Wayne Hibbert. Exactly. Who's no now more. fighting in BKB. Exactly. You so, know, so I can't wait to see that one get <laughs> That's going to be a crack of the rematch. Um, yes, Tom, but it's you know. Uh, what he's bringing to the uh, the BKB is, but you know, the, the, from, from the club boxing, uh, we've seen his skills and he gets a chance to show showcase his skills. He's one of the most elusive BKB fighters uh, I've seen, you know, in present day. Sean Joe has got absolute. I mean, he's such a tough, a tough Warri warrior, warrior, warrior. But he's know. been working. I was talking to his trainer. He's been working so hard, yeah. so hard on the. Improving his technical side. Yeah, I mean Sean George, he always brings, you know, he always brings a great fight to the table. You know, he's working on his semi, which is great. You know, if we find it with Trezise earlier on, he's been working on his technique a little bit more. We've got Sean George who's working on his but technique a, at, a little bit more. But, but look at the experience. Sean George has got ten wins, three defeats, yeah. two draws. Bags of XP. He's been in with the best as well, as in Jimmy Sweeney. Um, you know, another great BKB fighter. He's, he's working, right? He's working hard on his own job. Yep. But he's still preparing professionally yeah. for this. That's uh, hard work. Yeah, I'm mean, like you say, I'm a bit of a fan. I'm a bit of a fan of all the BKB fighters. I follow them yeah, on, me too. on social media. Me they too. follow me. You know, I, I've, I've seen with Sean, uh, Sean George, you know, I've seen him. He's at work one minute early on in the day, and then of an evening, he's in the gym, or early, early morning, he's in Three the gym. He's, yeah, getting he's up. doing his thing in the early on in the gym. Reminds me of you. <laughs> <laughs> see, how, see how I was stuck for work there for exactly. a minute. Exactly. <laughs> but you know, there, there's, I always, I don't know, you, listen, you've fought at the very, very pinnacle. You've won the world championship. Tell me, no matter how much ability you've got, surely hard work is the platform. Exactly. Listen, there's a combination of everything, Tom. You can have all the ability in the world, yeah? If you don't train, if you're not psychologically switched on, it ain't going to happen, yeah? You've got to be physically prepared, and that's what Sean George does. Sean George does. He goes to work, he gets up early, even earlier before he gets to work, he's in the gym or he's out doing his road work. And still, and still eating. And he's healthy, making weight. You know, brilliant, what a lifestyle. He, you know, he, he leads, tough lifestyle that he leads. You know, and that just goes to show he's a true professional. He was, he was telling me that he's really, you know, he's eating so... He's got down to 10-7. I think it's the first time since he was about 12 he's been 10 stone 7. <laughs> he said, but he, he's fixing his kid's tea. Yeah. And the smell of the cheese oh. and the... <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's driving him absolutely crackers. It's driving him absolutely crackers. As we get ready, as we get ready for our next fight, which is the world featherweight title fight between Tyler Goodjohn and Sean George. Over to our ring announcer, Lee Druitt. Ladies and gentlemen, your penultimate contest of the evening, scheduled for seven by two minute rounds, is for the BKB Featherweight Championship of the World. <laughs> Introducing first in the red corner with a professional BKB record of two wins and no losses. Fighting out of Ely, Cambridgeshire, and Rebin, the Finn Army! Tyler, El Tornado, Kucho! I'm gonna 
He'll have an entourage. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what, what happened? I, I'm a world champion. I never had an entourage like that. It's not fair. What's happening? <laughs> well, that's his girlfriend who's wearing the blonde wig. <coughs> fair play. We'll give him that one. And his opponent in the blue corner with a professional BKB record of 10 wins, two draws and three losses. He's a veteran of the BKB world, a former middleweight British champion, a former lightweight British champion, and the former lightweight champion of the world. Rebbing the Welsh Warriors, he is Sean the Outlaw. He's been a former Tour. lightweight champion. He's been a British champion. He's been a world champion, Sean George. He's been there, Tom. Yeah, he's got eight years on yeah. Tyler Good John. He's been there, he's done it all. It's going to be made for a very interesting fight this Tom. I think this could be the fight of the night. Fight of the night. If not, the best BKB fight ever. He's yeah. got that potential. Yeah, he's got the potential. Both men are serious, they're looking. They're up for the job in hand. You know, like you say, both men train hard. And both in brilliant shape. Brilliant shape. Tyler Goodjohn, who, we've watched him, he's got great technical ability. Yeah, beautiful. Uh, I mean, he's no, he's no Mayweather, but he's the BK, he's the BK version, if you like. You know, that movement, the slipping that he yeah. does, beautiful. Well, here comes Sean George, likeable Welshman from Abertillery. Tyler from Ely in Cambridgeshire. So England Wales contest again. Yep. And these are good guys, good mates outside the ring. Yeah, and like I say, we speak about this often, Tom. You know, the respect that these fighters have each other. So, well, they're all, they're all friends, they're all family. You know, and they know that they're going to fight each other at some point, at some day. And, you know, this day's come. And it's going to be interesting to see what the outcome is. You know, but once they, once they get in that ring, Tom, yeah. Once they start throwing digs, the respect's there, but that friendship goes out the window. Well, we will see now as his girlfriend gives him a little kiss to wish him luck. It's nice, that, isn't it? It's nice, isn't it? That's nice. My girlfriend never used to do that to me. Did she? She never. That's what I'm oh, saying. Right. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I don't like her. <laughs> as we get ready for... A contest that is mouth-watering. I've been so looking forward to this, well, to them all, but to this one particularly. This is a, a contrast of styles. Yeah. You know, you've got uh, Sean George, the taller opponent, longer reach. He likes to tear up, though, you know, he well, likes to get stuck in. I think, I'm looking, Sean George is the taller, isn't it? Yeah, and the longer reach, I'd say. He went in a 10-9, 11 stone Tyler. Barrington Patterson, the referee for this world title fight. Look at them, they're both bouncing, they're both ready to go. Seven two-minute rounds. First round. I mean, have you seen... Uh, George's calves. Look at the work. Look at his legs. Oh, no, and his amazing. Calves look at the amazing. strength in them legs. And calves, especially. I don't think I've seen bigger calves for such a small. You know, no, he's not a small guy, but that's for, obviously from road work and the work that he's doing. Your calves are not like that, were you? No. Both my calves are as thick as one of his calves. <laughs> as the both of them and George's. I have to say, Sean George's style looks really compact as well. Look. Yeah, and both guys just, you know, feeling each other out. Oh, uh, good John putting the, the pressure on slightly. George getting behind the jab, which is nice to see. Oh, good oh, shot. Good shot, good good shot. Cracking shot from George. Beautifully George. timed. Beautifully Absolutely timed. Perfect. Beautifully timed He's up, by George. He's, He's up, up quick. He's, but I think it was more, well, it was a good shot, but it was more shot than anything, I think, there, Tom. Absolutely. That was a great shot from George. He took his time, bad as his time. Teed him up with a couple of jabs and dropped the right hand in right on the temple. Now, I as always well. think, how do they bounce back from a knockdown? We'll see. Yeah. 
But he looks, you know, considering he went down pretty heavy there, he's hoping he looks quite fresh still. Good body shot from George. Good body shot. He looks focused, up. George. He does. He's picking his punches beautifully, Tom. Oh, Look at that. Straight. Oh, good shot from Good John. Yeah, good well. John. Just letting George know that he is there. Nice jab again from George. Just picking that. He's bobbing and weaving. Yeah. Oh, good oh. shot. That's a shot. Land in the same place on the temple. Um, Tom. Yeah. Down goes George from the great shot. He's up. They're both up. Look yep. ready to go. Wow. Well, I thought that was a 10-8, but it isn't. No. Nope. <laughs> that's going to be all level. George was dictating the fight. Never uh, dictating the round up until that point. Just shows you anything can happen. Anything can happen. It does. It does in big day, big. It does. Absolutely. That's what makes it so exciting. You know, it makes it such a great spot. Here's Jim. Here's Jim to tell us. I mean, we thought this was mouth-watering, Jim. Wow. Yeah, um, yeah, drawn round, one knock down two, each. Two Very close round as well. Um, yeah, just fantastic as we expected it. But we, you expected this from the off, didn't you, when, yeah, you, when yeah, you matched it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't expect so that, that you know two knockdowns. I must admit, I thought they were just gonna were they gonna be a war of attrition. I yeah. have to say, Sean George looks more technically adapted yeah, than I've seen him. Well, it, it's improving all the time. Yeah. Look, it's with Vince Cleverly who trained world yeah. champion glove boxes. It's gonna make a big difference. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you, Jim. See you, Jim. Just shows you, you can add, if if you add to the warrior status, the technical side of it. Well, you've got a fight. Exactly. You know this this fight, of, as we can see and as we can tell so far, a lot more technical than the earlier fights. Both fighters being technical, looking for the punches, not going and, wild. And you know what I'm looking and liking the movement. Yeah, movement. You know they're not going hell for leather. They're picking the punches. Yeah. Sean George putting his guard up nicely there when uh, Tyler Goodjohn, you know, tried to make it an attack. No, we know how George likes uh, he likes to turn up, but you know he, he's keeping composed, yeah. he's staying on the back foot, and looking at, his jabs. Look at his little shot there. He comes. It's one of them, not a long shot. Look, it's a short and, shot. And then the guards up, and that's why the guards straight up. You watch his right. Yeah. It's short. It's sharp. It's not long range. It's short and yeah. sharp. Even the jabs are just snappy little jabs. Yeah. He's not leaving it out there for too long. Oh, good shot again from George. Counter right hand. Good blocking as well from George. Uh, good, uh, good John side to the been, body. That's what's impressed me most is the defensive work of both of them yeah, when both needed. Both fighters and they're picking the shots well. Good shot. And, and he's just acknowledged. Yeah, he's just acknowledged. <laughs> Great shot. Oh, the trading blows now. Yep. Very. As mad as it sounds, it's a very defensive fight, but an attacking many, fight. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's strange, it's well, very well defended, yeah, but, but uh, exciting and, and action-packed, as I, mad as that sounds. The word I keep ringing in mind, explosive. Yes, you know, the picking the punch is nice, but not wasting shots, Tom, that's why Which I like. we've seen sometimes, yeah, that yeah. energy wasting on missed shots, these are two excellent performers, yeah. yeah. Wow. Dear, oh dear, what a fight. What a fight. Well, we expected it, to be fair, so we're not surprised. Yeah, I mean, you know, what? I, I was expecting a bit more of a turn, to be fair, but I'm actually enjoying what I'm seeing. I'm enjoying this more. The skillful side yeah, of it. Yeah, the skillful side of it than what I was expecting. I was expecting a turn up, toe-to-toe. -to -toe, um, I think Sean, you can see Sean George is having good, good, uh, good advice. Yeah, yeah, and he looks like he's enjoying himself in there. Yeah. So he's thinking, you can see him thinking and concentrating because we know he likes to tear up we know he likes to tear up here's jim to tell us i'm um, two drawn one for tyler um yeah that's that's how the fight i expected in that round a bit a bit more like that back and forth and taking shots and stuff but yeah great round though yeah and we're just saying you know sean george has noticed he's very compact he's very tight he's picking his shots well yeah. a bit different than the normal sean george that we've seen toe to toe he, 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 um, yeah and he, he's working on the inside Stinking. bend i've seen him absolutely yeah. great on. stuff thank you jim cheers jim we're off and running now for round three. See, as, as he gets hit, Sean, Ooh, no, yes. great shot. Great but as shot. he gets hit, he, he responds with a shot. Yeah. He doesn't take a shot and wait, he no. comes straight back. And he's fast, he's sharp, he's on the ball tonight. 
Look how sharp them shot them that them shots are. A little shot. Oh no, that was a no, that was that's a push. That, that's a that push. was a push. That's that a was push. A push. That's yeah, a push. There was a push. We saw I mean, the push. It, interested to see the replay, but it wasn't a punch. We'll have a look at the replay yeah. after the fight. It looked a push to it me. It looked like a slight push. I don't think it was intentionally to push him over. I think he was just getting his distance, uh, knocked him off balance a bit. Oh, good stuff Beautiful. from Beautiful. Sean George. And, and back comes good job. Back comes Sean George. What a good fight. Cracking fight, Tom. You know, both fighters still picking away like it's the first round, you know. Good body shot there from uh, Good John. Well, the two should pretty fit guys, yeah. aren't they? Yeah, they obviously trained, well, they train out every time. They're in great nick as per usual. Oh, beautiful shot. Tried the right uppercut, come back with the left hook. Just fell short. That's Good John, working the body. Oh, nice counter from uh, Good and John. again comes Good John, left and right. Back comes Sean George. Beautiful counters from George oh, again. Again, look at that going in, Alpha Leather. He's just told him, oh, yeah. I think he came across with a forearm and he wasn't happy with it. And that's what I'm, you know, what I'm liking about George as well. He's, he, he, he's not getting angry, he's not no, getting he's carried focused. away. He's focused. Even when he's taking digs, he's, he focuses the guards coming up. Look at that, look at that then. Just bobbed out of the way of his shot. Concentration on his face. Look, well, if any guards of, up. Uh, oh, good stuff good from shot, Good John. Good job. Good John's caught him twice there yeah. with good shots. No, but fair play to George, he kept the guard up tight, a couple got through, he tried a couple of counters of his own, he never quite got through, but... Cut on his, on his uh, nose, look, he's yeah. bad on... And the swelling, yeah, uh, nice swelling. Wow. Interesting stuff, though, isn't it? What a great fight. Fight well, we, we, we expected it to be, but, but I think it's better than yeah, we expected. It's, it's, exceeded, it's uh, exceeded our expectations. Absolutely, it's better than we expected. Um, the fix for that round for me, I thought that was a legitimate knockdown. I'd like to see that we one We thought back. it was a push. We, we both thought, thought it was a push. push. Was it? Okay. Yeah, okay. It'd be good to be see, see well, that We're going to have a look at the re... Um, Can all, we have a quick look now at the replay? All, all three um, Jim, all three have, have a look. Have a look. I think there's a shot just before, yeah. I missed that again, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. There's a gun. He's just coming again. I missed yeah. it again. <laughs> just, yeah. He took, you might be right, Jim. Yeah, I think there was a little shot. Just, was you it? know. Yeah, I still missed it. I can see why Barrington feeling it's difficult, yeah. but, you know, I just thought there's a little shot. We, that's the bad angle. The other yeah. angle would show it better. Yeah. Off we go now, round four. To be fair, on that angle, it look, we've got to be. Yeah, but just them are crucial things that can lose you a fight. Yeah, I mean, it, it might have been off the back end of a slight shot, but I think he lost his balance a little bit as well. But the replay shows it looked like a shot. I mean, a shot. I, yeah. We need it slowed down. Back comes good John. Straight, that straight. Sean George is dropping and tries that lovely. It's, I don't know, it's not really an uppercut, but it's sort of half an uppercut. Yeah, half uppercut. Well, I couldn't say jab, but half uppercut. It's hop, like a jab. Come uppercut, yeah, yeah exactly. Screw shot, screw shot we used to call it in the boxing trade. Is that trade. what you called it? Yeah, in the boxing trade, yeah. yeah. This is what I'm like, both guys still... St you can see the concentration still in the faces. And sticking to the plan. Sticking to the plan, concentration, controlling what they're doing, not getting too uh, carried away with it all. Oh, good jab from uh, from Tyler Goodwin. Good choice, sorry. And again, that little short from George. Ooh, nice oh, nice body good shot. Oh, good yeah. And good John. Nice movement from George. His Try head movement's excellent. Yeah. Oh, good oh, shot. There he is again, that screw right, right uppercut. Straight round. Oh, another, that right from Sean oh, George. George. Oh, three or four they tried there, everyone connected. Maybe not having the impact they thought they might both. But it's a devastating shot, that right. Yep. Another good round. Great round. I find it difficult to split these. Yeah. So tight, so close. George starting off, uh, starting off well. Good job coming back in the middle part of the round. 
I just thought George ended the, uh, ended the round a little bit better in my eyes. Absolutely. Interesting to see, but I mean, sometimes you think somebody's getting on top, then back comes yeah, the other back fighter. Comes the other, yeah, back comes the other guy. Great fight, absolutely, and, and worthy of a world title fight. Yes, definitely. Um, yeah, two for Sean, one for Tyler. Um, you know when the fighter, oh, that didn't hurt, that didn't hurt me. I think there's a few shots that did the, actually hurt <laughs> Tyler there. Yeah, um, for sure. But what a great round of fighting that was. The, the whole thing's been amazing, and I'm finding it difficult to call this one, Steve, still. It's, it, it's close, I think Tyler's just ahead, but it's very, very close. It's still all to play for. Absolutely, brilliant stuff. Thank you, Jim. Cheers, Jim. Excellent stuff. Just looking there and... They're both on their toes, look. Look, we're yeah. talking. Eager to go again. Good stuff again. And I tell you, they, seven two-minute rounds at this sort of pack. Oh, great shot great from shot George. From George. But, you know, you have to be fit to, to fight it like this. Yeah, at this pace as well. I mean, when they say at this pace, I mean, it's not a fast, but fast the tempo, pace. Yeah, the, the, the tempo's tempo. high. Yeah, the tempo oh, is high. Oh, good shot from good John. Most fights have up and down tempo, fast. Yeah. Uh, this, this is, is continual. The tempo is all the way through the round from, correct. Great right hands, you know, from Sean George. Yeah. Good head movement again from George. Tyler, good, uh, good John. Just putting the pressure on again. Jab to the body. That was nice. That was nice. The very, you know, was a bit of variation. Jab to the body. Trying to bring the hands down. Sean George comes forward again. That straight jab from Good John tries to get his man in the position. But then, that's what I like about Sean George. Yeah. He comes straight back. Yeah. He bobbed him, weaved. He got out of the way of the danger. And then Ooh, through one. Yeah, and he got good John caught, again. Caught with a good right hand then, though, from uh, Good John. Tried the right hand over the top and it landed. Good body shot from Good John again. That's what. That's good to see as well. Upper, lower, Go upper. Up, yep. That's what we like to see. Variation. Yep. That's a. That's a word. Variation of shots. Nice movement again from George. Just staying out of the way. Good will. Uh, good John. Looking to it. Good to John's eyes are marked badly there. Yep, yep. He tries that body shot. Good John. Yep. Devastating if he gets through. Oh. End of another round. And another high tempo, high energy. Yeah, and another tough round to call, Tom. Absolutely. It's hard to split the two. It is. So I'm, um, I'm literally struggling to split them. I mean, obviously the knockdown going against George in the earlier round, but absolutely. You know, apart from that, it's but they both went down, didn't they? Yep. Yep. Which was, which is why the first round was drawn. Coming into the sixth round, Jim. Um, two for Tyler, one for Sean. Again, that was a close round. That one. Uh, you, you know, could have gone either way, wasn't it? We finding it difficult with you to pull up. A line between them, two great fighters. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's and Jim. He's, he's improved technically, unbelievably. Oh, short million, judge. million times from the old days, million times. Yeah, great. It's, it might just come to who can dig in the most. Yeah, Literally, yeah. it might just come down to that. Down the, to tempo, the, the tempo of the fight. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Wow. Thank you, Jim. Round six. Round six. And the referee again wants the ring clean. Tyler likes that straight jab when he ducks into it. Just ducks and tries to get through to the solar plexus with the jab. You're right, you know, the head movement of both of them yeah, has been excellent. Yeah, both fighters, yeah. You're almost thinking, it's a, you don't want to win it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, I'll tell you what, we'll, I'm sure we'll see this one again, Tom. For sure, there'll be a rematch, whatever. It has whatever. to be, it has to be. Look at that head move. Oh, good shot. Oh, hang on. What's that for? 
Oh, he's told oh. him again about his arms. Oh, he's took the, that's a point that's off him. That's a point, so that left, where, where's that, that, what is that now, Tom? Well, that's Lafferty's round, I think, then. Uh, Lafferty's round, that's... Uh, yeah, George's round. George's round. Wow. Unless, of course, good John floors him. Yeah. But he had warned him about that. You don't want to lose it on a foul point, do you? No, it's a shame because he was such a good fight. You Absolutely. know, I mean, it's such a good fight, and you know, I don't think it has it as intention. You know, the elbows yeah. it's flaying. He's not up. using it's it not as a weapon. As a oh. weapon or intentional. He's just following through with it a bit too much, Tom, and that's the problem. Sometimes, though, fighters use a little thing like that against them to inspire them. Yep, exactly. Yep. You know, this might wind. You know, this might wind him up. Now he thinks he's got to put his foot, his foot on the gas again. Yeah. Take the fight to George. The pace still relentless. Oh, shot! Back comes good John. To absolutely. Guys at the top of their game in BKB. Yeah. Oh, Double good. jab oh, and good. then a return. Yeah. Good body shot. Yeah. Back of them. Look at this toe to toe. Toe to toe, literally. Oh, wow, what a fight. Boom, boom, boom. Wow. Wow. What an end to that round. What a round. What a round. I mean, this fight, this round, this fight, Tom has got everything in it. He's got everything in it. We've got knockdowns, we've had cuts, we've got bruises, we've got bumps, we've got skills, we've got body shots, we've got head shots. Wow. Well, we'll see what Jim said. What did the judges say, Jim? Um, with the point deduction, it short, that made it Sean's round. That's what we thought. But you've got to say, the end of that, have you ever seen anything like the end of that round? No, um, they just literally stood toe to toe, toe like two toe punching toe robots toe and just went for it. <laughs> Feet planted, wild swinging. What if round, Already, yeah. there's a round to go and I'm going to ask you, when's the rematch? I don't know, I just hope it's not a draw. <laughs> it's hard. got to be I've got too many grey hairs, I'm losing my hair to have another draw. To have the Welsh all calling me this and the other again, I can't take it. <laughs> Cheers, Jim. Last round? Well, I'm still difficult to call it. It's so tight. I, I think it's even going yep, into this. Even. Look at them. Look at them, both of them. Wow. There we go. Final round, seven two minute rounds, world title fight. I hate draws. I yeah, I mean I agree with you, but sometimes you know if like kissing your sister. <laughs> <laughs> but the way, the way I look at it, the way I look at it sometimes, Tom, with a draw is did he the fight and deserve to lose? Yeah, forget whether he deserved yeah. to win. Did he deserve to lose? If not, maybe go for the draw. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. You okay. know, when it's such a close tight fight. I don't like draws. No, I don't, nobody likes to see a draw. But like you say, you know, on a fight like this. But you're right. Who, Turn who it round. Who, who deserves to lose? Yeah, who nobody. deserves to lose? Nobody. Yeah. You see. So. But we'll see what the judges say. Yep. They could be totally seeing it from a totally different perspective. And there, either Tom. of these has got a knockout punch in them, by the way. Yep. Oh, look at Tyler Goodwin's right hand, look how swollen it is. Can you see that? Oh, it is. Oh, my word, yeah. But he's not letting him stop he's him. He's not letting him stop him. Tyler Goodjohn showing not only technical ability, but it looks like he's, Look at his hands, he looks like he's got gloves on. They're that, they're that swollen, Tom, look. Yeah. But there comes a point in fighting when you don't feel it. Uh, He'll feel it after. Yeah. Oh, look at the right hand, yeah. Yeah. Well, both hands, even his left hand swollen as yeah. well, but the right hand is... I was carrying on with, it, with that, I do not know. Pure grit and determination, Tom. But adrenaline and all that. Yep, he'll you, feel that tomorrow, you're right, Tom. Sure. Good look, shot from him. Look at him. Good shot. Well, I said to them, in the uh, interview I did with both of them last uh, today, this was potentially the fight of the night, if not 
ever. Yeah. And I think they've been they proved it. There's the belt on. Well, I can't wait to see who's won this. Obviously, Goodwin thinks he's going to go. He's won it. Sean George Sean thinks George he's won it. <laughs> he's a little bit quieter of the two, though. I, um, Sean George. I ain't calling it, if I'm honest. Match. Tom, Tom, as much as you like to, as you say, you, you hate draws, I'd have to get Maybe a draw. Maybe a draw. Maybe a draw to be fair, uh, Tom. Well, let's see what uh, see what happens. You'll be over there in a moment talking, and let's see what the official, first of all, is. But maybe Tyler feels a little bit hard done by with the push. Yep. That might have been a shot. We need to have a better look at that, Tom. Um, I need a better, a slow need, down yeah, look. slow down version. Yeah, it was hard to tell from the angles that we were seeing it from whether it was a push or but a push. George and others think it was a, a shot. Yeah. Look at him. Look yeah, at I was the just about fighters. to say, there we go. There's that respect again for both fighters for each other. Both knows what they've had to do to get it in this position. Both know what they've just gone through. Let's have a look at the knockdown quickly. Have, Robin, have a look at this. But we might have to stop it if the referee's ready. But let's have a look. No, that was the knockdown. Yeah, that's the George knockdown. Yeah. There it is. Hang on. No, we've seen that one. Yeah. That's the knockdown from George. And then there's. Oh, I'm not My sure. Yeah. No. Wow. I think if they're ready. There's the punch. Yes, it was yes. a punch. It was a punch. It was a punch. It was a punch. Absolutely. Yeah. So he was justified in. He was justified he in was complaining. Justified. Well, here we're going to go now and find out exactly what has happened in this wonderful fight. But he was spot on. Good yeah. John. It was a punch. It was a punch. We did struggle to see that first off, Tom. But he was right to complain about that one. Um, Well, the referee's calling them together. Massive hand to these absolute warriors, ladies and gentlemen. They have just put on an absolute BKB clinic for you all there. We go to the judges' scorecards, and we have a split decision. Judge Page scores it 64-63. Good job. <laughs> Judge White scores it 64-63. Short George. And Judge Kennelly scores it 67-65 to the winner and new BKB featherweight champion Tyler Antonio And I must have a Sean George. You find it hard to argue either way. Yeah, it was here. Yeah, I've got to say, this, I mean, I'm delighted for Starter Good John because he's a class act. I feel for Sean George because yeah. he's put everything yeah, into it. Yeah, but it was such a close fight, Tom, and he's lost there by a whisker. Um, you know, and, 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 good, and good John takes the win from the last judge by two points without the knockdown being called. So if that knockdown hadn't been called, um, did it have been a clear winner? An even clearer winner, a clearer winner. Yep. For me, though, oh, already, I think a rematch is an absolute yes, it has surge. to happen, Tom. It has to happen. I mean, what a fight. You know what I mean?
it'd be a crime not to have the uh, the rematch tom absolutely well i'm hoping that you know when you get to talk to them you may ask tyler if he's gonna if he fancies uh giving the rematch. sean a rematch yep that's the one Before you go and talk to them. I mean, look at the way those two guys just went for it in that, at the end of that round. Look, non-stop. Yeah, Robin's going to go over and talk to both Tyler Goodjohn and Sean George after what was an absolute classic, classic fight. One of the best we've seen at BKB. And uh, Robin's just ready to... Right, let's, I think we can, we can cross to Robin now. I think Robin's ready. Robin, are you, here he is. Robin talking to yes, the new world champion. Great fight, guys, ladies and gentlemen. Can I have a round of applause for that one again, please? What a great fight. We'll speak to you first, uh, Tyler, on that win. Um, go on, talk us through it. What a fight. Very close fight, though. I'll tell you what, I love, yeah. Like, <laughs> first round, he stuck me on my ass for the first time, so... Fucking hell, it was like a, it was a proper wake up call. Um, and yeah, like, man, he, he's one tough. And like, his skills are good. Like, do you know what? I come into this fight and I was like, I was a professional boxer, I was English champion, da da da. Tell you what, his skills are good, man. Like, and, and just tough, just tough, man. Um, yeah, man, I respected him before the fight, but even more now. Yeah, and that was great to see the respect in the fight. Over to you, Sean. Uh, tell us a little bit about the fight from your point of view. Yeah, it's cool, but you know, obviously he's a better boxer. I got no amateur career or nothing. I want to come in from Muay Thai and MMA. I want to adjust the bare knuckle. This is my 16th fight. I've already had the titles going on to my kids, but that means more to me than anything. And the respect I earn, that means more than the title. The better man won on the night, so be it. Fucking get me the McDonald's. <laughs> Did you get a close war fight? Some of them rounds were very hard to split. Did you think you'd won the fight? Or did you think that was a fair decision? Uh, I knew it was tit for tat. I knew he had one. I knew I had one. It's hard to keep, it's hard to keep tabs of the score when you're actually fighting. But at this weight, I knew I would eat them all day. As I say, put some cheese on the next ones. Great fight, guy. Over to you again, Tyler. Do, are you going to give him the rematch? We want to see a rematch. Are you going to give him the rematch? I think we're going to have to after that. That was a step. You've got to do it again. That was a wicked fight, definitely. Like, that was a sick Let him enjoy the moment first, man. He don't want my name hanging over him. And you're going up, Kev. Yeah, sorry, guys, we've got to talk about the rematch because I'm after worrying, obviously, after that first fight. Would you change anything in the rematch or are you not going to give that away at the moment? Yeah, like, do you know what? Like, he just, he just shocked me a lot, to be fair. It, like you say, it was so tit for tat. I thought I was going to be countering him and, and doing what I wanted, really. And it, mate, he just didn't give nothing away. Do you know what I mean? Like, Fair play to, to Vincent, his trainer as well. Like, great plan. Like. Yeah. Same question to you, Sean. Would you change anything different if the rematch happens and when it happens? Nah, it's fucking coming in the game as fuck again, but... A fair play to you. Great fight, guys. Great round of applause from the audiences on that last fight. Uh, great respect that you always show. Well done, guys. Back over to Tom. Very much indeed. Robin, thank you. Right, let's...